Okay, someone asked me to make a video about the difference between the white street sweeper and the black street sweeper. Well, basically, as you can see here, the white street sweeper is different because it's made in a different metal and it has different stones in there. These are white diamonds and the other are black diamonds. This is gold and this is 925 uh, sterling silver. Now, as far as the spiritual properties of these two, basically this ring here is about finance. It's about revenge against your opposition, physical opposition, where per se this one here is about love. This one here is about entombment to a higher purpose. Uh, this one here, it instead of like the directness of the black street sweeper to handle your opposition. This one handles your spiritual enemies. Those that are high ranking spiritual uh, adepts, you know, those that have close tie to the animal spirit. Basically, you know that they say sterling silver or silver in general, uh, basically is the weapon against, uh, werewolves or, you know, vampires whatsoever. And this is legend, but, you know, uh, according to uh, spirituality, there is a place for those. Basically, this is for, in my country, it protect, protects against Lugawu. It protects against uh, those who have a, a high connection to their animal soul, you know? So therefore, you know, give me an example, how would it be? Let's just say you have an opposition, you know, in that opposition, they have an animal soul. Their animal soul may be a bird. It can be a cat whatsoever. You may be walking down the street and you see a black cat or whatever cat, and that cat can be an omen of bad things to come. So before that even comes to you, this right here eliminates it. So instead of seeing that, whether it's a black bird or a black, black cat or whatever it is that represents, you know, the ill or woe that's supposed to come into your life, it eliminates it. So as you see the elimination of that, you'll see coming down the line that certain opposition may fall. So therefore, this one hits their animal soul before it hits their body, where per se, this one hits their body or hits their soul, you know? But again, this one here is also for lost love. So therefore, if you have lo if you have lovers from your past that you, you lost contact with, you know, basically it will uh, selectively pick that person. If, if the spirit feels that this person is good for you, it will definitely pull them back your way, or it can actually aid you with attracting new love into your life, you know? Um, basically, this one has a strong connection to weather magic, you know? So therefore wearing this, this kind of has a, this kind of has an influence over weather. But that's a whole nother story. It is something that you can really experience for you to get your own personal understanding of. But yes, you know, as far as this one is concerned, this is mainly like love and spiritual elevation and spiritual protection, where per se, where per se this one is more physical and it basically fights, it basically takes care of your, uh, physical enemies, where this one, again, I got to clarify this, is that it attacks the animal soul of the person, which reflects itself in hitting your target. So again, if you have an opposition that maybe, uh, you know, that has a connection to an animal soul, sometimes we come over, we come by people with where being spirits whatsoever, um, psychic vampires if so whatsoever. This will definitely knock them out the box before they even are able to come into your vicinity. So this is the difference between the two.